Right, from dinner to date night to whatever it is you want to do, there are some great new fall fashion finds out there right now. Here are a few of his favorite looks off the racks at Marks, by the way, is fashion guru Glenn Baxter. And before we start showing off the guys and what they're wearing this morning, Glenn, um, what are you noticing right now when it comes to uh, trends as we head into the fall? What do you see? Well, the one thing is that uh, we know that Canadian men love their denim. Okay. They love jeans. And this is the time of year where we can kind of look at our wardrobe, you know, transitioning from summer to fall and see what we have, what we need to add. And uh, Marx is offering over 200 styles of jeans for, for the Canadian man. It's a lot of jeans. It's a lot of jeans. They're, they're Canada's number one re uh, retailer for jeans, selling more jeans than anybody. So we've got uh, five uh, different looks for you this morning. Cool. Uh, beginning with Robin and our all Canadian look. The, this is the all Canadian look. We call right it now. the all Canadian look because yeah. obviously he's got a plaid shirt, which okay. is always cool. hot. And, and this one will fade with wash, like your denim. And, uh, you know, dark denim's great for, for date nights and for the office, but here we've got something a little more, um, you know, stylish with more aggressive stitching and, 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 a, and, a, and a lighter wash. And the bomber jacket, right? I always tell guys, if you can, we live in Canada, if you can, invest in one piece of outer wear every, yeah. every fall, winter. And this one's a good one. It's, it's downfilled and it's got a nice removable hood, so yeah. very versatile. Oh, cool. Very smart look. Oh, all right, okay, so who's next up now? Thanks, Robin. Uh, next up is Jeffrey. This is my favorite of the five. Okay. Because fall is all about layering, right? Sure, like, sure. Take today. Today, a beautiful sunny day, but when you come into work early, it's a little brisk, yeah, it's, it's eight, a little fresh. It's eight degrees right eight, now. It's yeah. eight, Ted would know. <laughs> so, but then you go out for lunch, and the sun is shining, and it's a little warmer. So you can come into work with the, uh, you know, the shirt, the cardigan, and the pea coat, but then you know, go out for lunch and leave the pea coat uh, behind and just wear the cardigan. Nice. So it's all about layering. Uh, and here it's all about fit. I love these, uh, these dark denim jeans. They're kind of like a straight leg slim fit, not to say skinny, yeah. and they do have a stretch. So a lot of guys are turned off by, by skinny jeans, right? Sure. They, they think it's uncomfortable. But uh, there's a lot of innovations now with uh, men's jeans, uh, including a sort of a more of a stretch fabric, so there's a lot of give. You don't even know you're wearing them. Cool. And it's all about fit. We got a no, no iron shirt. Because guys don't iron. Do you like to iron? I hate ironing. Exactly. This <laughs> way you never have to. To be brutally to. honest. No, it's true. I don't even yeah. own an iron. So, so this one you don't have to worry about. Just put it on and you're all set. All right, cool. Thank Thanks, you Jeff. very much. Yeah. And the next look, is there a nickname for this one or what? Uh, yeah. <laughs> Stylish yet simple. There right. you go. There it, you it's go. like being fashion forward but okay. without breaking the bank, right? Okay, yeah. Just a nice clean look and it's all about fit. When you're talking about menswear, it, it really is about uh, you know wearing the right size and how it fits. Uh, I mean, you're wearing a nice blazer, it's well tailored. That, that's the key to dressing well if you're a dude. Uh, and, and again, we've got, we've got some checks on the shirt, so the pants, we've just kept it very simple, mm -hmm. solid color uh, to play off, uh, I guess, the, you know, the, the, the loudness, if you will, uh, of the shirt. Yeah, so it's, the a shirt nice, it's a nice contrast, yeah, right? Exactly. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Excellent. All right. All right thank thanks, you very Mark. much. And uh, next up, Michael. Uh, Michael is wearing what we call a, a lumber chic. Or lumber not, chic. Not to say lumber sexual, which is a whole other thing. It's a different thing. Yeah. yeah. The, the lumber sexual actually, you know, the hipsters with the beards, yeah, totally. the well-groomed hipsters. Yeah, 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 yeah. With the sort of lumberjack inspired uh, look, the plaid shirt. So this is minus the beard. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> but we do have a, the, the plaid shirt. We've got the cargo pants, the Kodiak boots. And a, a, a great, uh, you know, all-purpose sort of uh, uh, vest. I like the vest. The vest is good too. It's yeah. water repellent. So sure, if it rains, sure. it'll just beat off. And it gets back to your kind of uh, focus. Well, a little bit of a focus on the whole layering thing this time of day. It's eight degrees right exactly. now, but come lunchtime, it could be twenty. Exactly. Yeah. And I always say, yeah, it's about layering. It's also, you know, fall is leather weather. So if you have a leather jacket, you pop it out. It's a good transitional period to, to, to wear some of these uh, nice. outfits. Yeah. Nice. All right. Thank you very much. I mean, for more information, how do people find out about Marks? You just go to marks.com. You've got okay. all the information there. Yeah. And, if, and then, you know, like the, there's so many great uh, uh, jeans uh, on the market right now. And uh, I always tell people, if you want to maintain the integrity of the jeans and keep them looking the way they look when you bought them, uh, because that's why you bought them. Sure. Uh, just either... Put them in the freezer. Okay. Right? In the freezer. Denim heads do that. If you're really serious about your... Apparently, the, the freezing temperature uh, kind of uh, uh, <laughs> destroys the odor-causing bacteria. Uh, I'm not, really? I'm, I'm not that extreme. Uh, I'll just uh, suggest putting it in the washing machine, cold water, yeah. air dry, air dry. And, and you can you'll you'll have uh, lots of longevity and you'll enjoy your jeans for years and years. Very cool. We have information on our <laughs> website, by the way, breakfasttelevision.ca. Didn't know about the freezer thing. Didn't know about that. It's a little extreme. A little extreme, but some <laughs> people are into it. Uh, our Mike Yanni is getting a lot of kids ready for hockey season down at Max Bell Arena this morning.